Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Wordle. This, or not Wordle, this is the hard Sudoku. <laughs> I'm not awake yet, can you tell? <sighs> anyway, it doesn't really help that my usual pattern of starting with the top three rows doesn't give me much. 5413279, I have no repeat digits there. Uh, 6328. 9186, okay, I can place an 8 in one of two places in row 5. In the bottom three rows, I'm only going to get a 3 as a repeat digit. Yeah, 4, 8, 9, 5, 7, 1. I have no repeats other than that. Wow. Okay, if I switch to vertical scanning... Um, two, five, six, one, eight, four, three, seven. I have nothing there either. And in the middle three columns, seven, nine, eight, six, three, one. I got nothing there. And in the rightmost columns, I'm only going to get a nine. Well, that's placed. Thankfully, it's right here. This nine, this nine, four, so nine. One of these two, and this one's ruled out because nine in row five looks to the right. Now. This 9 and this 9, we're now going to place that one. But unfortunately, that's where my luck is going to run out. And apparently this thing does have a unique solution. If I check here... Ah. Yeah. Okay. If I check here, it says the thing has one solution, and that's how I knew I transcribed it right. Now, let's see. Um, okay, these digits are 1, 4, 5, and 7. And this is restricted to 4 or 5. It can't be 1 or 7. Unfortunately, those can be anything. That doesn't help us much. 9 looks up, but 9's already in there. Uh, okay, both of these fours see that cell. That's not helpful. Okay, I need... That's nine looks up, that's not helpful. Eight looks up there. Unfortunately, I don't have an eight coming in to cross it with. Uh, column six has one, three, six, seven, nine as given digits. I need two, four, six, and eight. No, two, four... 5 and 8. This is not 4. And neither is that. But that one could be 4. Oh, 4 crosses a region. That's irritating. As noted, these are 1, 4, 5, 7. That doesn't help me. Okay, what about column 8? Am I going to get anything useful there? I'm going to end up with the same problem, I think, as column 6. I'm going to have at least one digit that crosses a region twice, and the, the hard way, and the other ones are going to do it the obvious way. 2, 3, 4, 5, 9, place, leaves 1, 6, 7, 8. Okay, oh, well, ah, this sees 1, 6, and 8, that's a 7. Alright, there we go. I'm going to mark that one a hidden single. Okay, ooh. Ah, well, that means these, these are 4 or 5, which means these are 1 and 7. Okay, that helps a little bit. I'm not... Okay, this is 1 or 6 because it can't be 8. Oh, well, this can't be 8 because of this. This can't be 8 because of that, so guess where 8 goes? It goes here. Okay, this is 1 or 6. And column 8 is done. Okay, I now have 5 digits in box 3 in a checkerboard pattern. I need 2, 4, 6, 7. 
this is 406, it can't be 2 or 7. So is that. <laughs> so guess what? These are 2 and 7. <sighs> Which means that that can't be 2, because it's got a 2-7 pair looking at it. Let's see. 2, 4, 6, 7, 9 are in those cells. These are 1, 3, 5, and 8. For the rest of row 3... And they go like that, and I get no help. But this 7 in row 6 will give me a fifth digit in that row, so let's see what I can do with that. I need 2, 3, 4, 5. This sees 2, 3, 5. That's a hidden 4. This is 2 or 5, but I think that's anything, and so is that. Well, not 2, but okay. And then 1, 3, 4, 6, 9 in box 4 means I need 2, 5, 7, 8. Well, this is 7 or 8. This is 2, 5, or 7. This is going to be 2, 5, or 8. Now, these digits, because they can't be 1, 6, 7, 8, 9, yeah, those are from 2, 3, 4, 5. And I think both of them could be anything, yep. Alright, these are from 1, 3, 4, 5, 6. Not one, not three. Hmm. Well, I have a lot of interesting scenarios in column seven, if I can figure out what one of the digits is. Uh, these are not one, three, four, nine. Oh, and I totally missed that those could be a 3 when I was vertically scanning. And these two are the only 3s in column 7. So 1349 says I need 2, 5, 6, 7, 8. In that configuration, and as expected, the 2, 7 down here means that's a mess. Let's see, one three five seven. Well, this is one three cannot be one three five six seven eight. This is two four nine in row nine column two. These aren't one three five seven. Nine's the only odd digit. Two, four, six, eight. That's season eight. Okay. I think this is two or six only. Because it sees all the odd digits. One, three, five, seven by row, nine by column, and then it sees four by box, eight by column. That one's two or six. Interesting. Okay, what are these? Not three, four, eight, nine. Those could be any of the remainings. And I've got five crossing a region the hard way. So that doesn't help me there, does it? Okay, what about these? Uh, one, three, four, eight have been placed. Ah, well. Okay, two is definitely there by this two seven pair and this given two. One, three, four, eight placed. <sighs> Looks like two, five, six, seven, nine. A 
which that can only be 6 or 7, it sees 2, 5, and 9. This is 5, 7, or 9, it can't be 2 or 6. Unfortunately, that's any of, uh, anything but 7. That's That one is also anything but 7. Okay, so 7 can't go here. Ah, yep. 7's there. I should have seen that coming from a mile away. Okay, these two cells are rather restricted. Those cannot be 3, 5, 7, 8, 9. So these are strictly 1, 2, 4, 6. Now, I've got a hidden 1, 6 pair here, and this can't be 4, so that's a 2. is hidden. That means this is 5. That, so that triple's resolved. That's going to do a, a lot more damage. Because those aren't 2. This is now not 2 or 5. That's an 8, 7, 2. 7 makes this 6. That's 1. These aren't 1. 3, 5 in here makes this an 8. This isn't 2, and neither of these are 6. 2, 5, 9, that's a triple, which makes this 7. 6 in column 1 is going to make this a 1. Uh, these two digits left are 3 and 8. And column 1 is complete. Oh, and this has an 8 looking at it. 3, 8, that's not 3. Okay, that can't be 2. Not 2 or 8. That's not an 8 because this 8 looks at it, so that's a 4. 5, 4, 6, 4. This is going to do a lot, of, a lot of damage. Okay, this is down to 1, 6, so this is down to 3, 4. Uh, 5 makes that 2, which comes down here. This is an 8. That column is done. 5, 9 makes this a 3. Okay, that leaves this as a pair. Uh, 1 and 6. I have a lot of 1 and 6s, don't I? 4, 3, uh, 5. Okay, this is a pair. 3 and 9, and that has a 3 looking at it. I can literally write those in. This is the other half of 4, 9, but this has a 4 looking at it, so 9 and 4 in column 2 are placed. Okay, that means those can't be 4. Uh, six, 2, 6, 9, that's a triple, which means this is an 8. Okay, so that's now 2, 7. Uh, 1 comes over here, that's 6. That's a 2, which makes this 7. That 2, that's 7. Um, the 6 is now going to come up. I just placed it, so 1 and 6 are done. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. This from 1, 2, 5, 6, 7. Well, this is 1 and 2, and 6 and 7 looking at it. This can only be a 1. No, that can be a 5. And now that's forced to be a 1. Okay, this is a pair. Yeah, we're solved at this point. 4, 7. Amazingly, that's not resolved yet. Uh, except by this 4. And, okay, this is, a, this is a known hidden single. That's a 6. Which fills column 3 and box 7. This is now a pair. 5 and 2. And I know the order. Nine, five, yep, this is, we're done. I'm just filling in digits at this point. One, seven, one, and six. And there we go. This was relatively straightforward. I put in dark red magenta the hidden digits that I found. You know, there was no 
quads or anything like that. Not really that many hidden triples either, and in fact, I really only marked one of them. Because it took a while to resolve. But this was a relatively straightforward solve, and thank you for joining me.